Hey everyone, thanks for watching today's tutorial and today we'll be creating this. For today's tutorial, we'll be learning more on continuous movement and blending mode. So let's begin. And we'll start by building our own design. Next, select the Stocks tab. Ophir is connected to the Unsplash platform and they provide a lot of royalty free images for you to start the project with. In this example, we'll be using the winter images. And select this. Scale the image up to fill the canvas and center it. Next, let's add some text into our canvas. For this example, we'll be using the Game of Thrones font and type in the first message. Adjust the spacing a little. Make it white. And duplicate it. Scale the text a little and place it to the center too. Now let's add in our product. We'll be using the beanie. Adjust the colors of the product. Bring down the saturation a tad and power out the contrast. Now we're done with the basic composition of our video. Time to add some textures in. To add textures, we'll be going to the stock tab and select this. Scale up the image and bring the layer down. Next, let's start blending these two images together. Select the adjust and select overlay. Bring down the transparency. Select the background image, go to filter and click grouping. After blending these two images together, we can create an abstract looking photo. Now let's start adding some animation into the canvas. Let's do a slow zoom for the background and the texture and give it like a 0.4. Do the same for the texture and give it a 0.7. Let's do a playback. With a simple trick like this, you can actually feel that the images and the textures are moving at different speed and that actually creates a 3D perspective movement. Now that we are done with the background, let's start adding some graphics into the canvas. For this example, we'll be using the smoke pack. And select this smoke. Scale it up. And I can flip the graphic by going to transform and click this button. So currently the smoke is actually blue. Let's adjust the smoke to make it a little bit more white. Bring down the contrast and saturation. And pump up the brightness. Let's do a preview. Once the colors is adjusted, let's duplicate this smoke again. Offset the timing. Scale up the graphic. Let's do a preview. Now that we got a smoke done, let's start working on the text and the product. So we will start scrolling the timeline, see when the smoke actually covers the screen. Somewhat here. Next, let's add a fading animation to the product and the text. Push the list to the front. And do a preview. So with this simple trick, we can create an illusion where this smoke is actually reviewing the text and the product. Once we're done with this, let's start adding our last graphic, which is the snow. For the snow, we'll be using the overlay graphics pack. Select the snow and scale it up. Bring the layer down and do a preview. And we got the entire animation done. Next, all you have to do is to select a music and render it. Thanks for watching this tutorial and I hope it actually helped you in creating your next video. See you next time.